And the big night has arrived. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the UEFA Europa League final. My name is Derek Ray. My co-commentator to help describe all the action is the former Arsenal defender Lee Dixon. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're just minutes away from kickoff time here. It's Brentford taking on Liverpool. Well, night games, European football, where does it get any better? Well, it does if you're in the final. But with finals, they're horrible if you lose. Make sure you win if you get here. Well, here's how the lineup looks for Brentford. We're thinking 4 3 3. Yeah, one central striker, Derek. The width comes from the wingers who will stay high and wide. A very narrow midfield and a conventional back four. This is how Liverpool start the game. Well, as a team, Lee, they love to apply almost suffocating pressure. Based on the lineup, do you expect the same approach today? Yeah, I think so, Derek. It makes it really difficult for the opponents to find their rhythm unless their touch is absolutely perfect. It forces mistakes, so I'd expect we'll be seeing plenty of that from them today. Rorsleb with it. And Pontus Janssen has it. Ivan Toni. And giving it away. And a goal kick will be next. Explosive attacking qualities can be so important. Look no further than Mo Salah. Well, he's got all sorts going on for him, this player. Trickery, I don't mind that. I can play against trickery. Pace is a bit more of a problem. As soon as you've got a player like that, you now have to manage him a lot, lot closer. Well, attacking possibilities. Henderson. Oh, stylish ball. What can they do now? Well, that is how to run at defenders. Henderson. Well, that's the kind of play you want from your defender. Over the touchline for a throw in. Alexander Arnold. Fabinho now. Konate. Salah. Alexander Arnold. Well, they keep working away, looking for an opening. And Thiago. Alexander Arnold. This is Thiago. Fabinho Henderson he's very adept at protecting the ball can they forge ahead well the pass not finding its target now the attack fizzled out pressing high to win the ball and it's gone out of play goal kick coming up
Christian Nurgard. Not a great pass. Oh, lovely ball. High pressing at its best. And a fine tackle. Firmino. Here's Thiago. Can they take the lead here? And a goal! The first of the contest! Well, it's always best to get your nose in front in the final. Really puts the pressure on the opposition. Well, here's the replay, and that passing and movement is pure quality. And the relaxed way he strikes that into the back of the net is pure quality. Well, he's got to be delighted with his players. A big smile on his face. They've got the noses in front. They're in the lead. Well done. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. What a bad pass it was. Oh, and a perfect ball now. How about this? Thiago. Well, it was a very good-looking move, but alas, no end product. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. And the Liverpool throw-in forthcoming. Andrew Robertson, Mane, here's Robertson, Fabinho, Roberto Firmino, it's with Fabinho, oh lovely weighted ball, they might be in, really important tackle. So two minutes of stoppage time here. Christian Nurgard, Jensen, and so the half-time whistle is sounded here in Manchester. The quest for Europa League success, and the second half of this final is underway. Salah Alexander Arnold Fabinho now Mane Virgil van Dijk Roberto Firmino Ibrahima Konate Henderson has it Roberto Firmino Henderson. This is Salah. Well, they keep passing away. Alexander Arnold. An effective challenge. Sorensen. And a throw-in forthcoming. And they've been getting two substitutes warmed up and both will come on here. Yeah. 
Milner. Liverpool have given it away. Half an hour remaining then. Jensen. And Pontus Jansen has it. Sergi Canos. Ibrahima Konate. Fabinho now. Mane. It's with Fabinho. Can the owner of the red Salah. Registration SNU. Alexander Arnold. Please return to your vehicle immediately. Thank you. Now Mane. Well, visionary passing. Could it be? Here we can take another look at it. You've got to ask questions about the keeper's positioning. That's half of his job. You can put the best keeper in the world the wrong side of the goal and he won't save anything. Well, enjoy the good days as a coach. It could be a roller coaster ride, I can tell you that. So 2-0 now. Goal for Liverpool, number seven, James Milner. Throw-ins given. Fabinho. Well, as we can see, Liverpool enjoying the bulk of possession here. If you have that much of the ball, you can put pressure on the opposition defence. And they look like they're creaking. That's why they're winning comfortably. Well, there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. And time for the change now. Alexander Arnold. Strength and control, a big part of his game. Sergi Canos. Real danger. Well, he could run onto it here. Mbermo. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. Now, high quality defending. Inside the final five minutes now. Nabi Keita. And Pontus Janssen has it. Using space on the opposite flank now. So two minutes to be added on at the end. This looks promising. Well, offside here. Such a pity for them. Chance was on. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Mane. And there's the whistle. This UEFA Europa League final has been decided. Disappointment on one side, but sheer jubilation on the other. And my goodness, Lee, they deserve it. Absolutely deserve it. They were running the clock down at the end. The referee obliged and blew his whistle. And quite rightly so. They're now on the halfway line celebrating with all their teammates. 
I'm pretty sure all the subs, etc., will come running on as well. A great, great night for this football club. That's a party to last throughout the year, I should think. They're very happy to be celebrating good times in the Europa League. And now the trophy awaits them. Well, all those months of hard training sessions, pre-season training, you kind of look forward to get yourself through those sessions. And they'll be looking forward at moments like this. They've finally got their hands on this fantastic, magnificent trophy. This is what they've wanted. Now it's in their possession. The winners of the UEFA Europa League.